Hey guys, Reversal here, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Go, and as I just arrived back home, we got some news from Pokemon Go that I wanted to share with you guys. I already have been reading a little bit through the keynote of uh, Niantic, they have been talking about the content gold rush, about how successful Niantic was with Pokemon Go, what Pokemon Go has done to achieve it, what the vision was, some statistics, and then also what happens in the future uh, for the game, kind of briefly. John Hankey, CEO of Niantic, has been talking about that at the Mobile World Congress. And I kind of wanted to share my thoughts, my opinions, and then of course what is being said with you guys. So that's why I'm sharing my screen here with my beautiful mouse. Let's go ahead and click over here. This was live coverage. Shout out to Drums from the Silver Road. Always, you know, taking one for the team, sharing everything, what is happening into the world of Pokemon Go. John Hankey takes the stage. I've been reading through this already, so that way I know what is going to be happening. And first, I'm going to be talking about the introduction about Pokemon Go, because not everybody at that conference was familiar with Pokemon Go, which is uh, kind of a strange thing when you think about it. It's such a worldwide phenomenon. They talk about how AR gaming is kind of different from regular gaming, I guess, uh, how it's changed. Uh, Poco launched last summer, it's probably the worst job of forecasting in my career. So, like, you know, server issues and such. And basically, this is about how Pokemon Go got successful. But the reason why I'm covering this is because towards the ending, there's some interesting pieces of information. As of December, folks have walked 8.7 billion kilometers. That's like 5 billion miles, by the way. That is insane. Everybody together, 8.7 billion kilometers. Alongside with that, everybody caught over 88 billion kilometers. Pokemon. Luckily, they're not in danger. There's plenty more. We'll just keep making them. Uh, I think Pokemon, Pokemon Go is kind of unique in the game that is really built to be native uh, to this world. It's fully designed to. It's really designed to fully exploit the capabilities of the handset and the capabilities of the network. Then over here, 650 million downloads ever for this game. 44. 44,600 terabyte of data has been transferred. Completely insane. We we'll rely on direct carrier billing for the financial underpinnings of this. Um, Pokestops, 35,000 Pokestops, not bad. And then over 500 million visits to these sponsored Pokestops. And then they talk about Starbucks, uh, Geo, uh, Unibill, you know, some some partners with Pokemon Go. It's not really that interesting for you guys out there. In Pokemon Go, we're only getting started with the game. We've just launched our first major update, 2017. 80 new species, Generation 2, of course. We have three major new releases for Pokemon Go mapped out this year. I want to talk a little bit more about that later. They're also saying, we're also working on a number of new gaming projects. Each for them represents a new opportunity to partner. We'll be launching our new version... We will be launching a new version of our original game, Ingress. And some other project I can disclose down, coming down uh, the pipeline. So they're working on other projects. There's going to be a brand new Ingress, as I already mentioned before. The older brother of Pokemon Go. I think that will be interesting to kind of look what that's like, I guess. I'll definitely cover it onto the channel. Give you guys like a, a review. Maybe it's like a game for you guys out there. At least I kind of want to see what it's like. So that might be pretty interesting. Maybe a couple of episodes of that. And they're saying that's it. If you not try Pokemon Go, there's Pokestops throughout the hall. Download it if you haven't, all, haven't done that already. So, in short, three major releases mapped out for this year. Also mentioned Gen 1 as the major update. This is good news all around. And I agree. It's, it is good news that, uh, that Pokemon Go is getting three major updates. Now, I already took to Twitter and I said like, well, maybe Shinies. But then you guys already were like, but, but Shinies is not a big feature. Listen, it's a big feature to me. But if it's not considered to be a big feature, then I think PvP, Generation 3, and then either Gym Optimization, like Gym Fixing, or trading but i don't think it will be trading because i i still think there's so much to, that needs to be done in order to you know get trading working i really think that pvp because john hankey is so specific about you know other features like trading is still kind of like collecting right and john hankey has been talking more about like other features or other perspectives of the game that they want to be focusing on now I would say that legendaries like big events is not necessarily 
a major release because it's something they have been working on already like major release more so relates to giant features i guess so there's of course going to be more than just the three releases or three new features but this this is just the big stuff as in people really are hoping for this and it's actually something that will add something to the game that's what i'm understanding when i'm saying feature so whenever i'm saying shinies that's not so much a feature that is an extra um same thing with legendaries that's not so much a feature that's an extra then you might you know draw the argument gen 3 not really a feature but should be a feature because it's like featuring new pokemon but you guys got the idea thoughts opinions leave them in the comment section down below what do you guys think the three big features are gonna be and if the new ingress is to be released are you gonna be playing it i would love to hear from you guys in the comments below anyway that's gonna be wrapping it up for me i have a bunch of stuff in my background because i just came back home wanted to record this immediately because later today hopefully there will be a vlog out so i'm gonna do everything within my power to make sure that actually gets released today but yes that's gonna be doing it for me for now I want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I eagerly await your comments in the comment section down below. Cannot wait what you guys have to say. And on that note, this has been Reverse for Pokemon Go. I'm going to be signing off and I'll see you guys in the next one.